15-year-old Billy Ellsworth of Kennedy Township is able to walk in and out of school every day and in and out of doctor's appointments every week, which is not something he takes for granted. Billy was diagnosed with Duchenne muscular dystrophy when he was four. He's had weekly infusion appointments through a clinical trial at the Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh for the past four years to receive the drug Ateplersen, which received preliminary FDA approval this week. I didn't expect I'd be told like, during a school day, like I'd be pulled out of class to be told it was approved. I didn't know. So, and then when I saw cameras, I didn't know like what that was for. He and his mom say the drug has slowed the progression of the disease. Both of them were stunned when they found out the news on Monday. But very happy, very happy what this means to muscular dystrophy, um, the, the whole world of muscular dystrophy and the, the potential future treatments. That's, I think, what I'm most happy about. Of course, I'm happy Billy gets to stay on drug. However, the cost for the drug will be expensive. It's estimated to cost at least $300,000 per year. She's not sure if insurance will cover the cost. But in the meantime, Billy and his caregivers, who he says are like family, celebrate their first victory. Everybody, I'll take a few. One, two, three, say approval. Hey! <laughs> For Times Online, I'm Kate Malangowski.